Hi, I'm Dan Yaccarino, and I write and illustrate children's books. And being that we're all sort of cooped up these days indoors, I thought it would be fun for me to read you guys one of my books. And today's book will be Giant Tess. So let's begin. Once upon a time, a baby named Tess was adopted and brought home. She began to grow and grow and grow until no one could deny it. Tess was a giant. A very hungry little giant. Tess knew she was big, but what she wanted more than anything was to be like everyone else. But she wasn't. On the morning of the big parade, Tess wanted to help with the preparations. But things didn't go as planned. Hey, watch it, everyone shouted. I'm just too big, Tess cried. She wanted to hide forever. After a while, she heard a low, sad howl. Maybe I can help, she said. It was a dragon, and he was hurt. She touched the spot where the dragon was hurting and pulled out a thorn. They not only became best friends right away, they were the same size. Tess named him Smokey. The parade was now in full swing. Tess and her new friend watched from inside the park. If only they could march too. All of a sudden, there were screams. A huge gust of wind had blown a parade balloon up into the air, taking someone with it. The mayor! We've got to help, Tess told Smokey, and the two of them flew up to rescue the mayor in 10 seconds flat. The mayor was very grateful. He asked Tess to be in the big parade. Smokey too, of course. Tess never felt she was too big ever again. In fact, she was just the right size. The end. Thank you for being such a good audience, and I will see you all very, very soon.